Hey friends, today I'll be showing a wireless portable thermo printer that my husband purchased for me. And this was a birthday gift. And it's English, it's an English printer, Bluetooth wireless printer, two hour battery life. It's got three adhesive rolls, two non adhesive rolls. And this is a bundle. And you have to download the app from Google Play or App Store. And the print, co uh, print um, it's 200 DPI image quality, Bluetooth wireless technology. It's, it's battery two hours of continuous use compatible with iOS 8 or above Android 4 4 or above dimension is 3.4 by 3.3 by 1.6 inches in the box you get the thermo printer three adhesive rolls two non adhesive rolls USB charging cable quick start guide and warranty card and this is Bluetooth so I'm going to unbox it and this only um this prints in black and white it uses a thermo paper so you don't need no ink for it you just get the thermo paper that already has the ink and that comes with some in here this is an inkless printer. It only prints in black and white. No color. So if that's going to be a problem, then you, <clears throat> you might not want it. And maybe I can print after I download the app. And it seems like they have it. Oh, well, they have it packed pretty good. And they have it in different colors. I think they have it in... What color is this? A purple one or a pink one? Mm. This one I think is pink. Or purple. I don't know, but... You can get this at HSN. You can get it at Walmart.com. They have it. And I think this is a purple one. But they have different colors. I think they have blue. This pink. Pink purple color. And I think they have it in white. And like a gray color. And I'm going to unbox it. And then I'm going to charge it. And then I'll come back and show you how it prints. So this is a little printer. And it comes with your little pet, your um, paper to tell you how to set it up. It says fully charged before initial use and make sure to disconnect from other nearby paired devices. Okay. Okay, so what I'm going to do, this is the unboxing of it. You get this. You get the directions. Let me put it here. And you get this um, USB charger. And you have to plug this into one of your plugs. And it's got one already in the printer. And then you get five more. So I'll be back after I download the app and let it charge. Hey friends, I just got done charging the printer and I have my instruction sheet. These are the two papers that came in the box. And this is, this printer is the Coors Innovation Printer. I don't know if you can see it. That's the name of the printer. And this is a 
thermo, a wireless portable thermo printer and that's the name of the company it took one hour and 15 minutes to, for the charging light to go off here and that's where you put your this here at the charge it and you plug this into another wall adapter so we have to put the paper I think it's already got a paper in here because you get five and I'm going to try to put the paper in here and this is instructions sheet that came with it and it's got all the what each light means when the lights off it's fully charged and it says load printer with load printer paper gently lift the release tabs to the open the printer so that would be the two tabs on the side here let's see if I can I don't know how to get it open. I never had this before, so it's really stuck. open it let me see what it says it says gently lift the tab to open the printer there it goes that one looks good up there we go okay I got it open and then it says Locate the instruction tab on the paper roll and place as shown. Okay, this has got one in it. Let me get that out. And it shows you how to put it in there. So by this paper, you have to put it in there like this. load paper this side okay okay there we go and then it says pull one in put it in there this way and then it says step three Pull one inch of the paper roll and place outside of the printer for optimum printing. Close the lid. Put about one inch outside the printer. I guess that's about an inch. And then close it. Here we go. On the My Printer page, search for Core Print on the available device listed and tap to connect okay I'm using my phone and I gotta find where I downloaded the app on here and it's instaprint that's the app on the my page search for let me see I don't know what they're talking about is it this my printer
the one I allow. I really don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm going to turn it on. Okay, I got that on. Let me see if I can get it to work. Cause this is new to me and I really don't know what I'm doing. Let me go back to the app. see if I can find it. Here it goes. See if I can print something. I got it on. Name Core Print. It says device connected. Okay. Let's go back to the go back home. Let's try to print something. It says you can print a picture. Oh, here's pictures I got in here. Let me see. Maybe put a picture of me. Let me see if I can find a picture. I guess I print that one. Okay. And let me go back. I gotta figure out how to work this. And there we go. That picture there I put in there. I don't know if you can see it. I'm gonna print that one if I can. Print picture. Okay, let me go and see if I can print it. Nope. 
Let me preview it. It's got different stuff you can do down at the bottom. You can change it. Do sketch on it. I want to do like that. Okay, I guess we're going to send it to the primer and see if it works. Let's see if it plants. Well, it prints. I think I messed it up. It prints. But I think I got it. Got it exactly right. I think it's scraping up right there. Let me try to do it again. You can change the color of it. Let's try it again. And this one print better. I really don't know what I'm doing with it. And this is just printed on the regular paper. You can make it darker. And that's the print of it. And that's the way it looks. When it prints out, that's me. And this was the first one I printed. I guess maybe the paper was messed up. But yeah, it works. That's that one. Let's see what else we can print. And you gotta have the you got to have the app on your phone. You have to download the app from Google or Apple. I'm not going to save that picture. You can make labels. It's got a glare on it. You can make notes, templates, print picture. It's got an image factory, banners. Let's see what this is, image factory. Oh, you can print all these out and the kids could color them. You can do stickers and cartoons. What else they got? You got templates in here. Like templates like this that you can print. We got fun stuff like this. You can print your pictures, you can make labels. What else they got? Let's see what labels. You can make labels for stuff. Okay. Let's go back. This is the app. This is banners. You can type your letters in there. Like say you want to say duties. Handmade creation. You could type something in there. Let's 
Let's go back and see what else we got. What's this draft? Oh, that's my picture. Templates. I can print these out to do. Like the do list. It's got these in there. And it's got festive. I guess this is all Christmas. And fun. I can print them out. These are templates. You could do labels. New notes. I don't know. And like if you want to do text on there. You can do your text on the new notes. You can type stuff. Stickers you can put on there. Like these stickers. When you type something up, you can make stickers with them. Got more. You can do plain text. I'll go back. Let's see what else. You can get stuff off the web. You can get stuff off of there. stickers and a cute little octopus you make name tags so you wanted to use that and make a name tag you can make your text big You can make. Oh, let's do it right. But the only thing is, this is be printed in black and white. You can't use color. This is only a black and white inkless printer. The ink is in the paper. So you don't need no ink for this. So it would print like in this, something like this. Now you want to go back and you can move it around. If you want to put like this in the middle, I guess you could move it over. I 
we just got to learn how to use it. Like if you want to put that in the middle, you could probably move that up. You could pick out another one of these. But it's only going to print in black and white. You could put an apple. You can erase it. Sorry for the glare. But I'm in front of the window and Yep, this only a print in black and white. I'm just showing you a little what's on here. And it does work because it printed out my picture here. You could put a flower in there, make it big or small. What is this here? No, I don't want to go to that. I gotta learn how to use this. But this is only gonna print in black and white, like I said. If you're looking for color, this is not gonna do it. It's gonna print in what do they call that? Stickers. I'm trying to see if that's the one I want to use. What is that, a hand? And you can change them. Like I said, you can go on the web and get you get plain text. If you just want text on there. That's cute. <laughs> yep, yeah, you can just pick out any sticker you want to make. I'm just learning it myself. I don't even know what I'm doing with it. You can go and do any picture you got on your phone. That's all the stickers. Yep, you can do. Let me try to print something else out before I end it. This is the image factory. I'm going to print one of these out. You can print these out for the kids and they can color them like this butterfly. And you could print that out. 
and let the kids color insert it. I got this on the dryer. I'm going to print this one that I saved. I'm going to print it. There's a little printer up there. I guess you press that. And it prints it. Then the kids could take and color these if you have any kids or grandkids. And just I'll rip it. And they can use the color. But like I said, it's only black and white. Yep, that's only black and white. Let me see if I got any colored pencils I can use. They can take and stick them to their notebooks or stick them to their gifts. And that's the one I printed with my picture. You can use these for your scrapbook. Yeah. That's a picture of me. And I don't know what color I'm going to do this butterfly. I've got these gel pens here. I'm going to sit in here and color it. I don't like the ones with the glitter. This has got glitter in it. Let's see how they... Yeah, you can take and color these and put them on your... Um, if you're using the one with the adhesive on it. I can do that. I'll color them. Put these on your scrapbook pages or I like this blue. Let's see if this blue works. These are them gel pens. Yeah, but like I said, this is inkless. I mean, um, you don't have to buy ink. The ink is in this paper here. This would be good to make labels. Our banners. Oh, that blue is pretty, ain't it? It's pretty blue. But like I said, the kids can... You can print these out and the kids can color them or whatever. They can stick them to their notebook. And you can get this at walmart.com for $29.88 or maybe your Walmart might have it in the store this little um, core innovation printer thermal printer You can print anything out you like. I think I'm going to do this yellow to brighten it up a little bit. I just wanted to see if this really worked. I 
and that, that looks like a glue and color. But yep, it works. So you can't go wrong with getting this printer. It works. I ain't very good at coloring with these pencils here. <clears throat> Let me put another blue over there. Let's try this blue over. And I guess I'll come back later and show more. I'm going to get, get me a little, um, my little wipey to go up here to get down. I don't like getting this stuff on my desk. So yeah, it works. The little printer. Because it printed this out. Got a little smeary there. Got a little, them gel pens, you gotta let them dry. And that's the printer. I mean, that's the picture I printed out with it. Love me. So, yes, this little printer really does work. But in black and white only. Thanks for watching. Be blessed. Bye-bye.